Thank you for joining me today on This Girl Plans. My name is Crystal and on this channel you will find planning, budgeting, and cash envelope stuffing. In today's video, I am going to be setting up my cash binders for 2023. I got all new envelopes this year and I changed my categories around. Um, last year I just had three binders and this year I'm going to have four. Um, I got these really cute envelopes from Dainty Pages, Dainty Pages Co. or um, Dainty, what is it? It's Dainty, Dainty Beginnings, I'm not sure, on Etsy. And she included this cute little sticker pack uh, because she knows that I'm a planner too. And she could just, she could just tell, like, or somehow she knew, I don't know how she knows, but she just said, I have a feeling you're a planner like I am, so here's a sticker pack. And I thought it was really sweet and super cute. And there's like a good number of stickers in here. So um, really excited to try these out too. Um, I also got a new wallet for this year just because I thought the outside was cute. I, um, I don't love the inside layout. I do like the layout of my current wallet better, but it's just looking kind of beat up. Um, it desperately has to get cleaned out. Look at all these receipts and stuff. But I do like this side. I like this better. This really works for me. It's quick and easy in the store. Um, but I'm sure I'll get used to this and, you know, if I could design my own wallets, that'd be really cool. If you, anybody knows how I can go about doing that, please let me know. Cause I'd really be interested in coming out with my own line of wallet designs. Okay, so for my first binder, that's like daily expenses and that sometimes this binder could go with me, but I do have the wallet envelopes as well. Um, this replenishes my wallet envelopes really is how I've been doing it. So um, I think I'm gonna use pink as that's what I've already had. And so I'm going to take out the old envelopes in here. This I don't know why I pulled this out. That doesn't need to come out. There was, these were all empty. If you watched my getting back on track video, you'll know there was nothing in those. All right, so in this binder, um, and she was so sweet, she um, rotated the tabs for me, the envelope sliders, because when they're all like going the same way, it makes them go like this after a while. So um, that was really sweet of her to do that for me. And I gave them to her, her in the order that I wanted my envelope. So she kept them in that order and rotated the sliders. So super sweet, awesome. And really quick turnaround time for how many or, uh, envelopes I got. Um, so it's gonna be food, gas, Pets, household, toiletries, spending money is just going to go straight into my wallet, um, laundry, And I didn't quite know where to put this category, but I'm going to be using it once a week. So Friday night game night is going in here as well. I'm really excited to start this feature. I really like watching these videos. I think it's really fun. And so I'm going to start including that in my budget. It may not be much and I haven't decided what categories I'm going to do yet for the game night, but um, I am excited to, <laughs> to start that. All right, so here is the, um, I'm calling these like my, my daily spending. Da, 
then what color do I want to use next? I think I'm gonna make this color order. Okay, so black. Um, these. This is gonna be my personal, my personal thinking buns. So it's a little bit. This is the new category for me. So these ones are. I'm just gonna take out the ones that don't have any money in them yet, or right currently. So then I don't have to flip through so many later. Okay. So I don't actually none of I don't think any of these are in this category. But okay, so I have one for my son. And if you're wondering why I got this pattern. And we'll see if it works. I have noticed in some videos that the words are kind of hard to see over the money and I really wanted my categories, the, the words to stand out. So I thought that having some background distraction and two different colors of letters that it would help them pop more. So once we put money in, we will see if that works. All right, so this is for my son, Zach. I mean, he's an adult now, but still, he needs to have his own binder. Um, I have been dating on and off, and so I have a boyfriend envelope. It doesn't have a name, obviously, because nothing serious, but still want to be prepared for what comes up. I, uh, beauty. Clothing. I actually remember to get a label for this one this time. Last time it was a blank envelope because I forgot to have a label made. Um, fun. Tattoos and piercings. I have a lot of piercings. Right now I don't have any tattoos yet, but I would like to. I have quite a few on my ears. I have my tongue. I have a Monroe, which is the one above my lip. And I have some dermals on my chest. I am addicted to plants. I have so many plants, you guys. Like, it's a problem. I splurge on them. I don't budget them. I just spend the money that's in my account on them. And that has to stop. So, I have to. I have to start budgeting them because I get really out of control. And I really need to stop buying plants and start buying more like nice pots and like stands and stuff for them. And, um, you know, special food for them, lights to keep them happy, things to protect them better in the winter. Like I need to start focusing on that more. And of course, planner supplies. That needs to have its own envelope too. That is another thing I have been bad about splurging on. Okay, so that is all for my personal sinking funds. So this is my fun binder of all like the stuff I wanna do. Not my like super responsible stuff, but like the stuff we need to enjoy life. Because if you're not, if you don't still do things to enjoy life, you're not gonna stick to your budget. So, super important, I think. Okay, so this binder is gonna be my short-term sinking funds. I need to take out the old envelopes in here. Uh, short-term sinking funds. I'm going to start with birthdays and gifts. Propane. Dump run. Um, now that I live in town, I don't have to, I have trash pickup, but it's still, you know, every once in a while, you need to go to the dump. Miscellaneous and unexpected.
auto expenses. I do actually really need to get this going soon. My car does need a $300 repair. It needs a new oil pan. I guess mine has a crack in it. So I've just been keeping an eye on my oil. <laughs> but it's kind of scary. A little Russian roulette there doing it that way. Holidays. So I do need to try to get that fixed soon. Christmas. Medical and dental. AAA renewal. Insurance. Registration. And PL box. So that is it for short term sinking funds. However, I have money for some of these. I know it, I know it. Okay, so birthdays and gifts, propane. Fifteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four. 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. Oh, good. Look at that. Okay. Pretty happy with that. You totally see the words. And the money doesn't distract from the words, in my opinion. So I'm really, really happy with my choice of going with these envelopes. Okay. Propane. Trash. Ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty five, twenty six, twenty seven, twenty eight. Miscellaneous and unexpected. Five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty one, twenty two, twenty three. Auto holidays. Ten, twenty, twenty five, thirty, thirty five, thirty six, thirty seven. Ten, twenty, thirty, forty, fifty, fifty five, sixty, sixty five, seventy, seventy one, seventy two. Registration. Fifty one, twenty, thirty, forty, fifty, fifty five, sixty, sixty five, sixty six. We'll see. And then the last binder is going to be long-term sinking funds. And this binder hasn't been used, so it 
doesn't want to stay open yet. I actually bought this one first and then decided I didn't want to use this color. And I bought these colors, but now I'm going to use it. All right, so let's see. That starts with emergency fund. That snowball. Additional credit card payments. Moving. Home decor. Home projects. Vacation. Month ahead. Future. Business. Retirement. And invest. envelopes stuffed. Now if you're wondering why I don't have like rent and utilities really, I pay those online for the most part. So like credit cards on my subscriptions and stuff, that money just stays in my checking. And so I don't have envelopes for them yet. But when I do reach my first goal of one month ahead, I will start having envelopes for those. And I'm just not at this time. And then once I get one month ahead, I am going to work towards being additional months ahead. But I know that that's a, a long ways down the line. Um, so just in case you were wondering why maybe it looks like I'm missing some envelopes, that that's why. All right, so emergency fund is 10, 15, 20, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32. One, two, three, four, five. This was mostly spent already. Just, oh, look at that. I bent it. Nope. It's still not right. <laughs> this is funny. It's all crinkled. If I remember, maybe I'll replace it. Uh, credit card payments. Moving. Twenty, forty, fifty, sixty, sixty-five, seventy, seventy-five, eighty, eighty-five, ninety. Home decor. Five. Home projects, I believe, has the same amount as home decor. I think it's going to be $10 as well. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Vacation, nothing. Month ahead. Twenty, forty, fifty, five. This is a 
bug in me over here. It's getting a little messy. Future. Twenty-five, six, seven, eight, twenty-eight. Business. Twenty-one, two, three, four. Retirement. That's a new envelope, a new category for me. So, not that anything for that previously. Five, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. We're in best. Yay. Okay. Yay. I am now officially moved into my cash envelope binders for 2023. I'm really determined to be successful and stick with these all year long. I'm going to move into my wallet, but my old wallet is just way too big of a disaster to, <laughs> to do on camera. So hope you'll join me for 2023 financial journey. If you have any questions, if you have any suggestions, please feel free to let me know. I'd be happy to talk to you. Hope you're all doing well and that 2023 is starting off on a good foot for you. All right. Take care. Bye.